Happy Market Monday, Fulton Montgomery County. It's Rob Taylor from Team Taylor and Keller Williams Capital District. And we are here with another Market Monday report. This is for the week of September 13th through the 20th. And uh, let's get rolling. So hopefully everybody enjoyed that beautiful weather we just had for the last two weeks. Um, we, this week, had 15 sales, um, pending transactions, whether active on the contract or regular pending. And that, compared to the last couple weeks, uh, we had, let's see, 21 sales uh, the week of the 9th through the 13th and the week before that, uh, which was the 6th through the 13th, we had 21. So, uh, as you, you know, give you a little context as to what we had and to what we have now. Um, and as always, these are single family houses and our source is the global MLS. So look right here, Northville and Kanjahari, no sales for the week. This Kanjahari has been running like this for a while. Um, so you kind of know what to expect here at Northville. As the lake season ends, we will see if this trend continues. But uh, again, those ones do not have any sales this week. As for our leader, Fonda, which is uh, good to see Fonda. The most transactions for the week with four. Amsterdam and Johnstown both tied with three. Amsterdam having three regular pending and Johnstown three active under contracts, meaning they still want to leave them active even though they are under contract. So uh, as for the... Uh, average days on market, number one was Broad Auburn, uh, eight. They only had one transaction, but hey, it was one that was only on the market eight days, 72,000. That is uh, definitely low for Broad Auburn, but maybe it's a fixer upper there. As for second place, Mayfield, their two transactions was 30 days on the market. So average price point, Johnstown had the highest sale of the week with 253,000. And that one is active under contract now. What that really means is that you still can take a look at it, even though it's under contract. Uh, Amsterdam, 137 was the average of the three sales they had this week. So that is good as well. As for the average price point, 100 to 150,000 was first with five transactions. Zero to 100 had four, as well as 100 to 200,000 had four transactions. And the only one with no transactions was 400,000 plus. We kind of should get ready for a lot of weeks of that, but we will keep you up to date as they come. If you know anybody that's looking to sell a property or looking to buy a property, it is actually, it's funny because it's good for both of them. Rates are very low right now. So if you're buying, that is good. You can get in there for a lower payment than as the rates go up. And properties, we don't have enough of them that are priced right and ready to go. So hopefully uh, you know somebody that needs those things and then we can point them in the right direction if they are ready. So talk to you next week. Enjoy the weather. Hopefully it's as good this week as it was last week. And we will see you next Market Monday. Have a great week.